Um, I want to briefly speak on the title God First. God First. Now, my question is, who do you run to in times of trouble? If the first thing that comes to your heart is not God, when you are in a hard time, then God is not first in your life. To put God first is to have the consciousness of God. The God you call when you are in trouble is the God you fear. So if God is actually first in your life, then it will affect your approach to Him. It will affect your relationship with Him. Putting God first is putting God's word first. Why are you doing what you are doing? Are you doing it because God told you to do it or are you doing it because you just feel like doing it? Unfortunately, some people even start doing ministry without putting God first. Putting God first is not about saying it. It's about doing it. There's a way you live your life. There's a way you pattern your life that will reflect that, okay, the number one person in your life is God. If God is truly first, in your life then you won't do anything significant in your life without seeking counsel from him have you cared to hear god on certain issues concerning your life what inspires you to take your decision is it god or what you see around what inspires you to do most of the things you do is it god or most things you see around if God is first in your life, then God begins to affect everything about your life. When you see a man, you know, when you see a man that, that is putting God first, you will know. Because the way their life will be patterned, their life will be patterned in such a way that you cannot come around them and not sense God. You can't come around them and not see God. You can't come around them and not perceive God. Such men have God in their lives and God is the first in their lives. So, every child of God must put God first. If you put God first, you won't come last. That's the mystery. The way to come first in life is to put God first. Are you there? Anytime you put God in any position in your life, apart from the first position, you may never come first. Many people want to make the top, they want to get to the top, they want to come first in life, but they are not putting God first. It is where you put God that you will end up finding yourself. So if you put God second, you may end up last. The best position, the only position that fits God in the life of a man is in the first position. Meaning that, now, putting God first now implies that you, 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 you treasure God's word more than any other thing around you. Advice, counsels from people are good, but you must take it to the scripture. You must compare everything you hear from people with the word of God. Are you there? So, at that point where the word of the Lord becomes your... You know your 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 final you know your final bus stop are you there at that point where the word of the lord becomes you know the only thing that moves you yes at that point god is first in your life when people don't seek god's counsel on most things they do it's only when they begin to face troubles and issues problems here and there that they now consult god are you there if God is an alternative in your life, it means that you are not putting God first. So, when you check the life of a man that is putting God first, God is not an alternative in such person's life. God is the main, you know, the main point. There, there's this worship song you sing, I have no other God but you. Can you see that? It's not, I have no other God like you. No, it is, I have no other God except you meaning that there is no other options if not you then it can be nobody if it is not God then it is no one that's how the life of a child of God is supposed to be 
I pray the Lord will give us, you know, the Lord will give us grace to always put him first in the name of Jesus. It's not about using God's first as your logo. You can be doing a business and, you know, your, your motto will be God first. And yet, if you come to that business, you won't find God there. So putting God first is not about writing it, writing it on, on your business or writing it. It's good, but the effectiveness is in doing it, is in living that life, living in that reality, you know, living in it to a point where God determines everything you do. God moves you to act. Are you there? Until you get to that point where God can influence everything around you, you are not putting God first. I pray the Lord helps us in Jesus' name.